Okay, good afternoon. This is our topic, the rectangular coordinate system. Objective to get the visual of ordered pairs of real numbers and to get the coordinates of the points. So this is our week 5 topic 1. Still, nasa first quarter module pa rin po tayo. But before we start our lesson, we have an activity. Imagine na ikaw ay nasa 0. Then ang may numbers... Sa right side niya, positive. Sa left side ay negative numbers. So, step 1. From 0, 3 steps to the right. So, nasaan ka ngayon? Okay, nasa 3. Next, 5 steps to the left. So, from 3, pupunta ka daw pakaliwa. So, mapupunta ka sa kay negative 2. Next, 2 steps to the left. From negative 2, maglilakad ka papunta ulit sa kaliwa. Mapupunta kay negative 4. Next, 8 steps to the right naman. Mapupunta kay positive 4. And last, we have 3 steps to the left. Mapupunta kay 1. At iiwan ko ang tanong na to sa inyo. How many times you pass by the number 3? Bahala na kayo sumagot dyan. Okay. So, our topic today is all about rectangular coordinate system. So, to construct a rectangular coordinate system, we have the horizontal and vertical axis meet at the origin point. So, ito yun. This is the vertical line or axis and horizontal axis. Yung intersections nilang dalawang line and nasa gitna, ang tawag sa kanya ay origin. The horizontal axis is called x-axis. And the vertical axis is called y-axis. Yung pahiga, si y-axis. Yung patayo, siya si y-axis. And number three, the horizontal and vertical axis divide the plane into four quadrants. The quadrant 1, quadrant 2, quadrant 3, and quadrant 4. In counterclockwise direction. So, ibig sabihin, Kung ang relo natin ay paklakwise, pabaliktad ang ikot natin. So, this is our quadrant 1, quadrant 2, quadrant 3, and quadrant 4. Take note, lahat ng may kita natin mga points sa quadrant 1, positive yung x, positive yung y. Sa quadrant 2, negative yung x, positive yung y. Sa quadrant 3, negative yung x, negative yung y. Sa quadrant 4, positive yung x, Negative yung y. Magagamit natin yung mga apat na sinabi ko mamaya. Okay. We have points na nakita tayo dito sa may quadrant 1. Ang tawag po dyan, the locations of a point on the Cartesian plane is represented by ordered pair. X and Y. Yung X na yan, may kita mo yan sa line ng x-axis. Yung Y naman, may kikita mo yan sa line ng y-axis. Ito x-axis or abscissa, y-axis or ordinate. Sa example, kuha ko ng point sa y-axis at saka sa x-axis. So, meron tayong 3, 4. Yung yellow dyan, yung number ng x-axis. Yung blue, number ng y-axis. Okay. The coordinates of a point are distance from axis. Yung layo nila. Okay. The x-coordinate or abscissa of the point is the distance from y-axis. And the y-coordinate or ordinate is the distance from the x-axis. Ibig sabihin, yung 3, ang layo niya kay y-axis. Yung 4, yung layo niya kay x-axis. Plotting a point at the Cartesian plane. First, we need to construct the Cartesian plane or Carter. Cartesian coordinate plane. Ayan. We have x-axis and y-axis. Take note, yung intersection nila, ang tawag ay origin. So, indicate the scale on each axis. Remember, on the x-axis, as you go from left to right, the number increases. On the y-axis, as you go from bottom to top, the number increases. Pero kapag binaligtad natin yan, from right to left, or origin to left, pababa yung number mo. Pero kung mula ka sa top, at nag-bottom ka, decreases yun. 
Okay. So example, from origin, papunta tayo sa right side. Tapos, umangat tayo. Therefore, yung ordered pair natin makikita natin sa quadrant 1. Means positive, positive yun. Kasi increases, increases. Next naman, from origin to left, tapos umangat ka. Para decrease, decreases, then increases. Ibig sabihin, from origin to left ka sa y-axis at umangat ka to uh, x-axis, tapos umangat ka to y-axis, nasa quadrant 2 may kita yung point na yun. Next, left, then pababa sa quadrant 3 natin makikita. Next, to the right, tapos bumaba sa quadrant 4 naman natin makikita. Okay. The origin of the coordinates, 0, 0, is where x-axis and y-axis intersect. Yan. Ang coordinate tone niyan ay 0, 0. Yan. Imagine you have two number lines, tapos in-intersect mo sila sa same number which is 0, 0. Yun ang origin nila. Minsan, pag sinabi natin origin, that's the starting point kung paano tayo mag-plot ng mga ordered pairs or coordinates. Okay. Number 5, always start at the origin. Move either to the left or the right of the origin if the sign of the abscissa is negative or positive. Respectively, then move up or down depending on the sign of the ordinate, whether positive or negative respectively. Try natin gawin yung mga 5 steps na yan. Okay. This is our Cartesian plane. Pansin natin, yung arrow na x-axis to the right, positive number. Yung arrow number ng mga y-axis pataas, positive number. To the left, negative. Pababa, negative. So, let's have an example. Plot the following points. Tandaan, yung first number ng ordered pair may kita natin sa number line ng x. The second number ng ordered pair may kita natin sa number line ng y. Okay, first one, 3, 2. The ordered pair is 3, 2. Our x here is positive and our y is positive. So, from the origin daw, maglalakad tayo to the right ng tatlong beses. Ayan, kung nakikita nyo. Uh, Nag-stop tayo kay 3 sa x-axis. Then, aangat tayo ng dalawang beses papunta sa y-axis. Ayan. So, ang location ng point natin kung saan tayo nag-stop. Ayan. So, dito natin makikita si... 2. Next, 0, 4. Ang x natin, 0. So, ibig sabihin, assist lang tayo sa origin. Pero, haangat tayo ng apat na beses kasi positive yung 4. Ayan. So, therefore, nasa y-axis ang location ni 0, 4. Kasi, 0 ang x. Next, number 3. Negative 5, 6. Our x is negative. So, it means to the left tayo. Pero, yung y natin, positive. So, pataas. So, here, papakita ko lang kung paano pa ang ibang way to plot ang given point. Unang ginawa ko, hinanap ko muna si negative 5 and 6. And I construct a line vertically sa x-axis and horizontally sa y-axis ng given ng mga coordinates. So, saan nag-meet yung dalawang line na yan, that will be the locations of our point. So, dyan makikita si negative 5, 6. Next, number 4. Negative 3, 0. Si y, 0. Ibig sabihin, hindi tayo aangat o bababa kasi 0 si y. Pero, pupunta, pupunta tayo ng pakaliwa kasi negative si x na tatlong beses. So, ayan lang yung locations ni negative 3, 0. Number 5. Okay, for number 5, we try, to, we try to find the locations of this point without constructing a line or mga guhit-guhit na yan. Okay, imagine natin. So, this is our negative 4. Bababa daw tayo ng 6 na beses. So, pagbaba natin ng 6 na beses, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, dito ang locations ng point natin. Ayan. So, dyan si negative 4, 6. Next, 0, 3. 
Zero si x pero negative yung y natin. So, bababa tayo ng tatlong beses. 1, 2, 3. So, dito natin makikita yung locations ni 0, negative 3. Ayan. And number 7, positive si x, negative si y. We have 6, negative 5. So, to the right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Bababa tayo ng limang beses. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, dito natin may kita ang locations ng point natin na si 6, negative 5. Ayan. And last, number 8, we have 5, 0. 0 si y. So, it means hindi tayo tataas or bababa. Pero positive si x, kaya to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, dito natin makita ang locations ng point. So, ayan na yung mga ordered pairs natin. Nalocate na natin sila. So, after we locate those given points, ang gagawin naman natin, we need to determine the quadrant in which each of the following points is located. Okay. Number 1, 3, 2. X is positive, Y is positive, therefore, sa quadrant 1. Number 2, 0, 4. 0 yung X, so therefore, may number yung Y, which is 4, nasa Y axis siya. And number 3, negative si X, positive si Y, nasa quadrant 2 siya. At saka napapansin din naman natin sa location, sa ano, quadrant 2. Y-axis, quadrant 1. Number 4, andito siya sa may X-axis. Wala siya sa mga quadrant. So, therefore, X-axis siya makita. Number 5, negative 4, negative 6. Ayan. So, ibig sabihin, makikita natin yung mga points na negative, negative sa quadrant 3. Next, 0, negative 3. Nasa y-axis. Ayan o. Line ng y-axis. Negative of y-axis. Ayan. Number 7. 6, negative 5. Ito. Nasa quadrant 4. Therefore, yung positive x, negative y, makikita natin lahat yun sa quadrant 4. And last one. 5, 0. Ayan. Makikita natin siya sa x-axis. Positive of x-axis. At yun lang. Thank you. Kamang sambila. Arigato. Sese.